This is a track from the Everly Brothers and it's called Dream. And we can break this track down into three different parts, okay? Like an intro, a verse, and a middle, right? Okay, so the intro is C, A minor, F, and G. So it's one and two and one and two and one and two and one. Yeah, so on and so forth. So that's the kind of timing behind it. Now with the right hand, you're just looking for something simple like... So it's one and two and one and two. All down strokes. One and two, one and two and one and two and one and two. Yeah? So try and base your strumming around that as a starting point. Okay, so that's the intro. Now, once we've played that twice, we go into a verse. And the verse is very, very similar to that. The only difference is that rather than playing an F, we replace that F with a D minor. And a D minor chord, you just use your first finger on the first string of the first fret. Your second finger on the third string of the second fret. And your third finger on the second string of the third fret. Okay? And... As with many D kind of bass chords, we just play the bottom four strings. Okay, like so. So, for the verse, we have C, A minor, D minor, and G. Okay? So just that D minor replaces the F. Everything else stays the same. And... The vocal which goes over that part is when I need you in my arms when I need you and all your charms. Okay, so again that section is played twice, just like the intro. And once we've played the verse twice, we go back to the intro for one section. Alright, so let me show you what I mean. From the very top, intro, verse, back to intro, and the part which just precedes the middle part. Alright, so it goes like this. Dream, 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 dream. Okay, so the only part that we haven't covered is that dream, okay, which is at the end of the intro part. Dream. So let me just play you the middle section. That C7 chord is the last chord before the middle section. All right, so I'll play it and then I'll come back and explain what's happening in the middle section. So from the C7. I can make you mine Taste your lips and wine Anytime, night or day Only trouble is Gee whiz, I'm dreaming my life away So before we finish off, let me just explain the middle section to you, okay? Once we play that C7, okay, coming into the middle section, we have an F, make you mine, E minor, taste your lips of wine, E minor is just 4th and 5th strings on the 2nd fret, okay, then back to that D minor we looked at, any time, to a G, night or C, B. Now you can hold the C or you can play another C7. Only trouble is, which is F, E minor again, G is, and 
then a D7, which is second string on the first fret and first and third on the second fret, and just play the four again. I'm dreaming my life away to a G, and then a G7 if you want. When I back into a verse. Okay, so hopefully that's kind of, you know, kind of self-explanatory and there's, you know, not too much left to the imagination, as I say. So good luck with that and I'll see you shortly for another one.